le pas pour la propagande. The National Front Youth are on the march. Brexit. 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 <laughs> the FN is a strong contender for the upcoming presidential elections in France, spurred on in part by a highly motivated and organized youth movement. Eric is a 20-year-old baker with political ambitions. He felt shunned by the elitism of traditional parties, and after flirting with a left-wing party, the NPA, he joined the National Front. I think the French, the, 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 the Franks, Yos, want a strong politic, a real politic, direct the, the politics, and stop um, all the, the, the 40 years of immigration and laxism politics we had. These young men, some from France's top universities, are campaigning for a leader they hope can bring change. We asked them which of her qualities they rated most highly. Patriotic, honest and free. Identity, sovereignty, security. Authority, she is classy, charismatic. Disillusioned by corruption scandals and tired of broken promises, these men are hopeful Le Pen can bring change to a youth concerned by identity issues and racked by 26% unemployment rates among 15 to 24-year-olds. Almost 30% of young people say they could vote for the National Front, a party long associated with the far right, but which has since rebranded itself as the fresh face of alternative politics. Young people in France are significantly less likely to vote than the broader population, leaving many asking how the FN has succeeded in galvanizing this support. It has tried, to be fair, to make room and involve uh, the young in uh, all echelons of, of, of the party. So Le Pen, at least, is the promise of something new, something which, you know, let's try something new. So that probably uh, is more appealing to the young than the rest of the electorate, notably the elderly. <laughs> the FN hopes to capitalize on a generation desperate for a new brand of politics. In one of France's most unpredictable elections, these young comrades, as they refer to one another, could potentially tip the balance. Miriam Francois, TRT World, Paris.